Hello, my name is Joseph Lanasa and I am a technical writer for Synergy Advisors. Today I'd like to show you how the Microsoft RMS sharing application enables users to view protected documents on their mobile devices. In the past, consumption of RMS protected documents was limited to Windows computers. Now, the RMS sharing application allows users to view protected files on iOS and Android devices. This feature is available with both cloud-based Azure RMS and the on-premises ADRMS offering through the mobile device extension. Here, Chase has opened a Word document he would like to share with a coworker. He clicks Share Protected, a one-click option to share a protected copy of the document. Chase inputs his coworker's email in the user field. He can use a slider bar to grant Leia granular permissions over the document, in this case granting Leia view-only permissions. Additionally, he can choose to apply content expiration to the document. Finally, Chase selects the option to receive a notification when Leia opens the file. This feature allows content authors to receive an email in near real time when a user attempts to access the protected content. Chase reviews the options and clicks send. Notice the draft mail message with two protected files attached. The RMS sharing application attaches both a copy of the protected original document and a copy in PDF format. This PDF file enables users to view protected documents on their mobile devices through the RMS sharing application. Chase reviews the message and sends it to Leia. Now, Leia opens the message from Chase from her iOS device. She'll click the attachment and select Open in RMS sharing to open the document in the RMS sharing application. Notice the pop-up stating that the document is protected, listing the permissions Leia has over the file. Leia can now view the document. Now, let's take a look at this experience from an Android device. Leia will open the message from Chase. Leia clicks Save to download the PDF file. Once downloaded, Leia clicks the document, which opens natively in the RMS sharing application. The pop-up pane appears stating that the document is protected, listing the permissions Leia has over the file. Leia is now able to view the document. Throughout this video, I've shown you how you can use the RMS sharing application to send protected files to users. We've also explored how the RMS sharing application enables users to view protected files on their mobile devices. Please visit youtube.com slash Synergy Advisors to view more videos on Microsoft RMS and its integration with additional applications. Synergy Advisors provides consultancy and training focused on information protection with Microsoft RMS. For more information on how Microsoft RMS can simplify your information protection needs, please visit our website at synergyadvisors.biz or the Microsoft RMS website at microsoft.com/rms. Thank you for watching.